Okay, so today I'm back for another video. Today I'm gonna be playing some Sims 4. Shout out to Jelly for the inspiration of this little mini series that I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna be working off the same idea, but I'm gonna be taking it a whole step further. Meet the bust household. First off, we have Jordy. As you can see, there's <laughs> been a slight exaggeration of our characters, although the nose is completely perfect. These, on the other hand, are a bit too big, maybe, but that's how we're going to be doing this kind of series. Everything's just going to be completely crazy and unrealistic. Face shape is perfect. The hair it's not quite, it's, it'll do. Also, the clothing that he's chosen, oh yeah, uh, he's also really thin, but that's pretty much accurate. These are his clothing, clothing options. They're all kind of orangish. He's, yep, he was topless in that one, as well as that one. As you know, Geordie likes being topless. Oh, yeah. Here we've got Jelly. As you know, Jelly has a cute little nose. Little disclaimer as well before I say is I actually didn't create these characters. Someone made them for me and I decided that they were just so amazing to use. The traits I'll come on to a second as well because kind of they were half done by me, half done by someone else. But we'll get there. The hair is pretty accurate to kind of like after shower. Haven't been to the barbers in a while, Jelly. And as you can see, he's kind of put on a bit of weight. He's also been to the gym, exercising his biceps. His uh, quads, and that's about it. <laughs> Every, uh, um, yeah, everything else is thin. <laughs> Uh, except for his belly, that's very big. <laughs> in terms of clothing, Jelly is rocking the green colour as normal. Also, he's going for the uh, stylish jeans for some reason. Formal, uh, sports, sleep, and party? I don't know what he's wearing for the party. <laughs> I don't know what's with his shoes. He's wearing like pointy loafers. But you know, I'm not judging Jelly. And yeah, swimming costume. Flipping heck, Jelly, you got a six pack. That is the fattest six pack I've ever seen. And now if you move on to me, um, as you can see, they have the nose on point right now. Not sure about the beard though. I don't can't really grow something like that, but you know, we'll just roll with it. The hair's pretty accurate. Yeah, it's not bad actually. And uh, the body shape is a slightly accentuated butt. But you know what? I'll take that. That's fine. <laughs> and uh, everything else, he just looks like a flipping chunk ball for some reason. Here's the clothing. That's his normal one. Formal one. For some reason, I have no trousers. I'm not questioning it. Sports, sleep, party, and swimwear. So that's pretty normal. Now, the traits we've got going, there's like three different types of personality that we're going to be working with to create the weirdest sort of situations as possible. Jordy's character is like a psychopath. Uh... <laughs> businessman type thing, some Wolf of Wall Street level stuff. Uh, he is <laughs> insane, but cheerful, and also a geek. And yeah, he, he's business savvy. So, we'll be, yeah, I think he's gonna be taken over the world by the looks of it. Jelly's character is uh, kind of like the crazy brute, but he has a light side, as you can see. He's He wants to find a soulmate. <laughs> but he's also slobby, lazy, and hot-headed. <laughs> So yeah, he's the um, he's the bit of the brute who just wants to find a friend. My character's um, playing off as an evil supervillain, basically. I've been given evil, mean, and clumsy, and I want to be a, become a public enemy. So that was that's very nice flipping traits that are given to me, though. But yeah, pretty much in order, we've got the psychopath, the uh, ragey one, and the evil genius. That, that's kind of what we're working with. Okay, so welcome to Newcrest. This is the neighborhood that we're going to be dealing with for a couple of episodes, maybe even for a while. Uh, this is the little section we're going to be concentrating up here. We chucked a few houses over here, but we're going to be building our own house. So me and the bus household are moving in on this little plot here. And I guess in the future, if you guys let me know in the comments, we can move in some other YouTubers to these houses over here. And uh, we'll, we can go visit them. Flipping out, that house is expensive. I wonder who's going to live there. But yeah, anyway, let's go uh, go check out our new house. So the aim of this episode is we're going to be trying to build a house. And we're also going to start up a club. Now these are something that they've added literally in a DLC that just came out. Where basically you can start up a club. And then you can get in like fights with other clubs. And that's kind of what the kind of theme of this miniseries is going to be. Where we get into a club and we try and just take over and uh, like kill all the other clubs. So the club leader is going to be my character slog and we're gonna add jelly and Jordy to the club so we can actually choose the club activities that we're gonna be getting up to now I don't I haven't actually looked at these but uh, let's see what we can find ah so some of the stuff we can get up to is hacking possessing objects roaring sabotaging objects and using alien powers 
So I think we pretty much want to go for most of these. Uh, raw uh, to, to everyone. Yeah, that'll, that sounds good. We want to, um, what else do we want to do? We want to possess objects. I don't know how we're going to do that. But <laughs> that's fine. Use alien powers. Yeah, okay. And what else can we get up to? Sabotage objects. Is there anything else we can do? Anything else? Home activities? And, and browse the web. Because as you guys know, that's pretty much what we spend most of our days doing. The name, we're going to call it Robust. And the description is going to be... We are mean. It's also going to be invite only. And we can select our club hangout. Where, where are we going to do it? Isn't there a, isn't there a, like a library right near us? There we go. So our club hangout is the library just down the road. Because as you know, super villains love libraries. And you can also get club points and get perks with them and become an infamous club. Get secret handshakes as well. So yeah, <laughs> that'll be interesting. Okay, so now the club's set up, we can actually do hangouts and stuff like that. But as you can see, wait, what the hell is this person doing? Say hello. Hello. Rude introduction. Let's go get this girl. How dare you come walk into our territory? What the hell is she doing? <laughs> Oh, what the hell? Just shake that butt. Yes. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, now she's mean. Now she's all upset. Oh, wait. She's waving. We just rudely introduced her, and now she's still hanging. So we just told Josh to mock her outfit. Um, <laughs> can you see his face? <laughs> Will she not leave? Okay, let's yell at her now. How about that? We are literally arguing with what looks like an eight-year-old girl. So our evil genius is, is, is going great. So this person, <laughs> this is this person, she's like just trying to get involved in the conversation. No one's talking to her. Whereas I'm just shouting at this little girl. Uh, what else can I do? Mock outfit. Okay. What, uh, anything else? Yell at. There we go. Um, oh, look, we can actually do specific things. Imply mother is a llama. Wow. I bet you that's her mum. Wait, what's she doing? Is anyone actually talking to her? All right, anyway, enough of that. Let's get into building our house. Now, I'm going to kind of like either speed it up or just skip straight through this because obviously you guys don't want to spend ages looking at it. But once I've done the basic structure of it, then uh, obviously I'll show you guys some more of what's going on and what we're going to be doing. Another thing I wanted to mention as well is we're not going to be doing any cheating in this series. So, yeah, we're all going to have to get jobs and stuff like that so we can make money to spend on our evil things that we get up to or whatever the hell happens <laughs> and there we go our first house i've just finished building the kind of the basics of it uh i'm probably gonna change these windows because they is ugly as hell but let's have a look inside oh whoops that was not okay here we go this is the so far the robust household now let me just give you guys a little tour now we're gonna finish off the furnishings together and you guys can let me know what you think of that in a bit. So don't look at all that. But these are the, this is how the layout is. So this is like the entry area. This is going to be our lounge, our kitchen. This is the bathroom. And then these are the bedrooms. This is my bedroom. This is Geordie's bedroom. And that one's Jelly's bedroom. <laughs> so let's get into the furnishings of the place. So what do we want to do? We want to um, get some kitchen counters. Let's get rid of this crap for now. And uh, hang on. I'm probably wasting up. Actually, no. We can keep you. And we'll chuck you. Okay. So at the beginning, we've we've got eight thousand dollars left. So we can't go crazy. Um, oh, a pink fridge. I like the sound of that. Yeah, we can't go completely crazy. Uh, so we're gonna try and keep as keep cheap as possible with the stuff that we get. Um, let's go. Let's go with the basic kind of white. St what, what is that? No, oh, that don't look nice. Let's let's go. Let's go. No, nah, that doesn't really work. Let's just go with blue. Blue sounds nice to me. Uh, that one, that one there. Yeah, guys, I <laughs> this one is is going to be an interesting series because some really weird stuff's going to go on, and not being particularly specific with the things that I'm putting down right now. So don't worry about that. So we also need a sink, don't we? We have one of those, but we just threw it away. Uh, another cheap one there. We could also do have a microwave because uh, Jordy always needs someone to talk to. Let's go with pink. That seems nice. I don't know what, what's with the pink thing going on. But let's just roll with it. We need a bin, don't we? That'll just do. Can I just get this bin? We'll turn that one around and put it right there. No. Why don't you sit against the wall? Hang on. Let's get a bigger one, shall we? Um, Shall we just get this one? Is that, why do they always sit so far? Oh, look. There's a little dinosaur one. There we go. Perfect. I think we need a bin outside. Should we just put one there now? 
I, I don't know. I think we need that. I'm fairly sure we do anyway. So what else do we need? Some higher up kitchen cabinets? That could be nice. Can, can I even fit these in? I can't. I put the windows there and they're kind of in the way now. Let's put one there and one there. Well, that looks ugly as hell, but that's okay. And what else? Far nah, that's fine. We don't need a fire alarm. Who needs those? Uh, you need those, by the way. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's move on to the lounge, I think, is the next. Where, where is the lounge? Do you have to click? Oh, well, let's do a bathroom, actually. So we want to get a shower. Um, what the hell? So this is some, some of the new items. I, what even is this shower? <laughs> it's just not even a proper shower. This is a flipping outdoor shower. Let's just go with uh, the cheapest one. We, we really don't have that much money left, so we're trying to keep it cheap. I don't think we need a bathtub. We'll, we'll skip that. Um, a sink. How do we... Should we put that here? I think that looks good. And lastly, a toilet. Um, <laughs> why is there a bush in the toilet section? Can you actually... What the... <laughs> um... Um, yeah, let's, um, should we put that bush outside? Let's just put that there and get an actual toilet. Um, what's the cheapest one? This one here. Okay, there we go. There's our toilet. Perfect. So that's the bathroom done. We'll add some more stuff later on. But for now, oh, we probably need some to toilet paper. Do, we, do they need toilet? We don't need toilet paper. Who uses toilet paper? So let's do the, the lounge. Where's the lounge? Just as a disclaimer, most of this episode is going to be sorting all this stuff out. In the next episode, we'll get up to getting jobs and stuff like that. So, where, what do we, what do we want, sofa wise? Um, we want. Let's start going a bit crazy at this point. Wait, isn't that crazy expensive? One thousand two hundred. Can we can't afford that? Okay, well, it looks like we're just getting a log for our first sofa. It's okay, you know. Well, it's, it's not the end of the world. And what's this coffee table? This is probably where they're going to be eating. So it's, uh, we're gonna make it not too bad. What's this, a rock? What the hell? <laughs> okay. All right, well, we've got a rock as our coffee table. Man, we, you know, we're really having to cut in uh, costs. And a penguin tea. Okay, that might be a bit too small, actually. Um, what, what, what do I, what, can I put it on something? Uh, can, can I, can I get a table or something to put it on? Oh, there's so much choice. Let's get one of these stands and then we can put it on there. Uh, what, what do we have? This is just so much. Okay, a box. That'll do. Just a box. <laughs> How do we turn that around? There we go. And then we'll chuck our TV on there. Perfect. Look at that. That is what you call entertainment. <laughs> so, what, what else do we need? We need to sort out the bedrooms now. This whole area, we'll work on that in the future when we have some more money. Because at the moment, we is poor. We've got 5,000 left to spend on a bed. Okay, I might be a slightly... Wait, can you sleep in this? You can sleep in the bush. This bush just seems to be useful for everything. All right, here we go. So, I'm gonna... Let's just... Um, what are the bed options here? Um, okay, well, this is gonna be... No, we can't choose that. This is gonna be my bed. <laughs> How much is that? 750. Right. That's my bed. Actually, wait. Oh, I wanted to make it... Oh, wait, you can set it for the same price. Okay, can I get a red one? Get a pink one. That'll do. Boom. There we go. So we've got my bed. Um, Geordie can have... What can Geordie have? Geordie can have this bed. Uh, <laughs> and Jelly... Jelly can have a bush. No, that's going to take up his entire bedroom. <laughs> Let's not give Jelly that. Let's just give Jelly this one here. Alright, there we go. So I don't know what... So it looks like Geordie's sleeping on a camp bed. And Jelly sleeping on a five-year-old's bed. So that seems about right to me. What about um, stuff to put your clothes in, guys? Uh, do, you, do you need any of that? No? Okay, that's fine. Then we'll, we'll just leave that for now. Although Geordie does Geordie does need a teddy... Wait, what the hell is this? <laughs> Geordie, there you go. You get a dinosaur. <laughs> Perfect! I think that's our bedroom's done. Actually, I'm going to put a wardrobe in mine. Just because, you know, I actually do change my clothes. Whereas these guys, they don't really... Do. There we go. Perfect. I'll have that. Nope. Turn around. Perfect. My room is looking great. So let's invite the guys in and see what they see of their new home. So basically the Sims, they're on like a auto thing. So they do a lot of their own stuff unless I tell them to. So come on, Josh. Let's go um, Let's go watch TV. Sabotage the TV. Okay, it's already begun. Geordie, um, you can go sleep. 
Uh, we'll sit together. What the hell does that mean? And Jelly, you can go and cook something. That sounds great. Sabotage. What? <laughs> okay. So about everything's getting sabotaged this video. <laughs> We're already destroying all of our stuff just because I'm in. What the hell is Jelly doing? <laughs> How is Jelly really sleepy already? Dude, wake up. <laughs> so I just sabotaged the TV. I wonder what happens. Jelly, are you? What? Yeah, just, 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 just jab the fridge with a screwdriver. That'll work. So let's get Geordie to come. Um, oh, what the hell's going on over here? Oh, pfft, he just walked straight off. So let's get Geordie to go use the TV. Um, there we go. Oh no, no, no. He's, he's. Oh no, he's decided not. He was going to the toilet, and now he's decided he's not going to bother. So what happens? Wait, what? How is this sabotaged? This item is about to break. Okay, well, I think we've broken our TV. And I think if someone goes to use the fridge, that'll break as well. <gasps> I know what we should do. Wait, what? Geordie's... Geordie can talk to himself. <laughs> Alright, that sounds about right. What the hell is Jelly doing? Tell me he's not sabotaging the toilet. Jelly just sabotaged the toilet! <laughs> okay. Um, maybe they're taking this job activity thing a bit too much that th this this gang's getting out of control look <laughs> stop sabotaging everything so now he's decided to sabotage the sink we might need to um let make the gang just chill out a bit on that front oh they're already in a gathering we're actually earning points from this what can we send up oh look we can make ourselves uh okay yeah we we just became infamous which is cool. What else can we spend it on? We've only got 100 left. What does this do? Homework boost. I, I don't think we'll be needing that one. Um, club vibe? No, I think we'll just save up some points for now. And we'll see what we can get in a bit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, well, our TV has broken. But don't worry. Jordy can fix it. All right? Jordy's on the job. In the meantime... Jelly, stop sabotaging everything. In the meantime, Josh is going to cook some hamburger cake all right so you get up to that and uh jordy will just be here <laughs> jelly <laughs> he's, so, he's so happy with himself he's like yeah <laughs> okay it looks like we're probably gonna need someone with a good um fixing skill though he is a he's a isn't he a geek or something that means he's probably good at it i don't even know i hope these guys are all happy by the way with their with what they're doing. What, what's, how's Josh going? Well, the fridge is broken. That's great. Because Jelly just walked around sabotaging everything. And now he's just standing there doing nothing. How about you just nap lazily? <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> I'll see you later, Jelly. <laughs> how's it going over here, Josh? Is it good? Is it good? Yeah? Alright, good to hear. Oh, wait. I think Jordy just fixed it. He's left some stuff on the ground. Um, And... <laughs> Please, what the hell? Wait, what the hell? Jelly can play in those parts. Get get out of bed, Jelly. We haven't got all day. What 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 happens when you play in the mechanical parts? What's he gonna do? <laughs> okay, Jelly. <laughs> all right. Well, you have fun, Jelly. Um. Oh look, the hamburger cake's done. Jordy, taste some of that. What are you fixing now? <laughs> okay. Wait, what the hell did you just do? <laughs> he just fired. All right, Jordy, I want you to try the um the cake. That I just Josh put a lot of effort into that. Wait, you can. Okay, let's uh. Wait, where'd you get? Take a piece. There we go. Enjoy it. To let me know how it is. Oh, he just grabbed that. For some reason, Josh is now fixing the TV as well. I don't. And and Jordy is uncomfortable. I I'm not surprised to be honest. Wait, I just sabotaged. Everyone just keeps sabotaging everything. Can you just chill out, please? Okay. Well, I think that pretty much wraps up the episode. Jelly's just taking a, a pee sitting down. It's all right, Jelly. I don't judge. And yeah, there we go. So this is the house we're going to be chilling with for a bit until we get some more money. Next episode, we're going to get some jobs for these guys. Because at the moment, they're just bums. Jordy's just sitting there eating hamburger cake. I don't know if it's a hamburger or a cake. And Josh is just sitting there. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and now Jordy's getting angry. Cool. Well, we'll leave them to it. 
and we'll see them in the next episode, hopefully. Let me know in the comments if I like the video if you want to see more. And also let me know in the comments if you want to see other YouTubers to come out and uh, join our little town. They'll be moving into these houses over here. This really nice one, and then these two not so nice ones as well. So thank you for watching this episode, and uh, yeah, let me know if there's anything I can improve as well, and I'll see you next time. Bye! Thank <laughs> you.